Greetings. Welcome to Sunday Morning Announcements with the Kathy Gray Avatar and the Bobby Blanche Avatar and the Rita Jackson Avatar. Bobby, you're up first. If you're with us on Facebook or YouTube, please subscribe to get notifications when we have new videos. If you're with us on Zoom, say hi to my cat. Uh, I mean, if you're with us on Zoom, say hi in the chat. We'd love to say hello back. If you're with us in person, hello, everybody here. And if this is your first visit, please sign the guest book either in the lobby or online at oakcliffuu.org forward slash guest. It's me again with a question. Have you seen our UUCOC board members hanging out in the pass-through to the sanctuary on Sunday mornings at 9.30 before our services? They're taking turns every week answering questions and talking with our members and visitors about the church. We hope you can take advantage of this opportunity, either in person or online via Zoom. Today, we have a change in our service. We are featuring a homily by Rev. Susan Frederick Gray, A Love to Change the World from a morning service at the UUA's General Assembly in 2019. We hope you can stick around after the service today for Talkback, where we gather in a circle and discuss the service and related topics. For those online, see the Zoom chat at the end of the service for the meeting information. Adult Religious Exploration with Sarah Rickey is starting a new topic, UU Who's Who, a look at important people from UU history. Today, abolitionist, suffragist, and poet Francis Harper. Join in person at 1115 in the Hope Library or on Zoom. At 1 p.m., the Church Board of Trustees will meet in Charity North and on Zoom. The meeting is open to all. Please note that all of our on-campus meetings are now being held in the Charity North meeting room. Normally, we'd have Jazz Jam this afternoon, but it's been rescheduled for next Sunday. See you then from 3 to 5 p.m. Uh, something about conflict with a football game. Something. Coming up this week, our Widening the Circle of Concern work group continues to meet on Monday at 7 p.m. Please join us by attending the weekly meeting and or submitting your comments and suggestions via email at wcoc at oakcliffuu.org. The Coordinating Council will meet online Tuesday the 13th at 7 p.m. And please go ahead and mark your calendar for a special event on March 5th. Our first Tuesday Social Justice Film Festival will present what's described as a gorgeous, provocative, and insightful film, Black Art in the Absence of Light. This film showcases the work of some of the foremost African-American visual artists, including Theaster Gates, Carrie James Marshall, Faith Ringgold, Amy Sherald, Carrie Mae Weems, and many others. The First Tuesday Film Festival is co-sponsored by the Dallas Peace and Justice Center, and special thanks to benefactors Carol Dingley and Olinka Green for helping support this screening. Our Administrative Assistant Rita has an important message. Admin Rita has an important message. Thank you, announcer voice Rita Avatar. Hey! I know almost every one of you volunteered your time and talent to keep our church running in 2023. This church would not even exist without you. Could you do one more little thing, though? If you worked on committees or projects or volunteered your time in other ways and you didn't sign a paper time tracker, please record your time online at oakcliffuu.org slash Volunteer 2023. Now show me some love and do it by Valentine's Day, February 14th, so I can do my spreadsheet magic and report back to the congregation. If you aren't sure if your time has been recorded, check your Breeze profile or contact Rita, <laughs> I mean contact me, at admin at oakcliffuu.org. Now back to Announcer voice, Rita Avatar. <coughs> <coughs> Keep watching your eBlast newsletter for more info and all of this and more. If you aren't receiving the eBlast, just sign up at oakcliffuu.org slash enews. It's 
easy. Thank you, Rita. There's one more thing. We have a member birthday to celebrate this week, and it's my baby, Jocelyn Gray. Okay, that's it for now. Have a great week from all of us.